Overview, The Mad Monk, 1993, is a Hong Kong comedy action film directed by Johnny Tu, starring Stephen Chow as the titular Mad Monk, alongside Maggie Chung and Anthony Wong. Known for blending slapstick humor with action, the movie is set in a fantastical period where deities interact with mortals. Chow's character, Monk Ji Gong, is tasked by the heavens to reform three morally corrupt individuals in a short period to prove the worth of humanity. Plot Summary Monk Ji Gong, known for his eccentric ways, is an immortal being who causes disruption in the heavens. To test him, three heavenly deities give him a mission on earth, he must reform a prostitute, Maggie Chung, a beggar, Anthony Wong, and a scholar-turned-murderer. If he fails, Ji Gong will lose his immortality. The story unfolds as Ji Gong uses unconventional and often comedic methods to reform these individuals while battling other spiritual forces. Performances Stephen Chow's performance as the mad monk Ji Gong is the film's strongest asset. His signature comedic style, marked by exaggerated facial expressions and physical comedy, brings charm to a role that otherwise could have felt too whimsical. Chow's combination of slapstick humor and moral undertones fits the character of Ji Gong, a monk who is both carefree and serious about his mission. Maggie Chung, in a relatively less comedic role as a prostitute, brings some emotional depth to the film. While her character arc doesn't stand out as much, she delivers a consistent performance that balances out the movie's zany energy. Anthony Wong as the beggar adds an additional layer of humor, though his role is primarily in service of the film's comedic tone. Direction and Tone Johnny Two's direction strikes a balance between comedy and action, but the overall tone is inconsistent. The film swings wildly from slapstick to more serious moments, creating a disjointed viewing experience. The plot's episodic nature, where Ji Gong moves from one character to the next, lacks cohesion, making the film feel fragmented at times. Themes and execution, the central theme of redemption is presented with a light-hearted touch, making it less impactful than intended. The film explores Ji Gong's mission to show that even the most corrupt individuals can be saved, but the script doesn't fully develop these characters' moral struggles. As a result, the transformations feel superficial and rushed. Visuals and action, the film features some inventive and over-the-top action sequences that play into the fantasy setting. However, the special effects and fight choreography are average by Hong Kong cinema standards of the time. Some of the action scenes blend seamlessly with the film's comedic tone, but others feel tacked on, serving only to fill runtime rather than enhance the story. Humor Chow's humor relies heavily on absurdity and exaggeration, and this works well in some sequences, particularly when he interacts with otherworldly beings. However, much of the comedy feels repetitive, with slapstick taking precedence over witty dialogue or clever satire. For a modern audience, this reliance on physical humor may feel a bit stale. Final Thoughts The Mad Monk delivers an entertaining but uneven experience. It's a film where Stephen Chow's comedic talents shine, but the script and direction don't fully capitalize on the film's potential. The story's moral core is underdeveloped, and while the humor works in parts, it lacks the sharpness found in some of Chow's other films, for viewers seeking light-hearted, mindless entertainment with flashes of humor and action, The Mad Monk will offer some enjoyable moments.